Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today's video, as you can see from the title, is my most obsessed top 10 recommendations for the current Spring Sephora sale. This is not a sponsored video. I don't make anything from Sephora. I am just sharing my most obsessed items, things that I think that are totally worth it, things that I think you should take advantage of during the sale and are like my true and just, I'm obsessed. I buy these things, repurchase them. Some of them are new favorites that I can't imagine living without viral products that are actually worth it and I just want to help you guys so that you're not spending money they don't need to and I am somebody who has tried so many products and I wouldn't steer you guys wrong. So guys, you know the drill. Make sure you like, subscribe, and hit that bell so you're notified when all my videos go live because I have already made my Sephora current, the Sephora sale, a big basket of items. I'm so excited. Some of them are repurchases, some of them are new products, and if you don't wanna miss out on what I've purchased, you're notified so you don't miss out, and it supports me, which I'm so appreciative of, and I just wanna say thank you so much if you are watching my videos. If you've come across my channel, welcome. My name is Abby. I am a certified personal trainer, holistic nutrition coach, and national bikini body bodybuilding champion and I love everything from fitness, lifestyle and beauty. You blend it all together, that's what you're gonna get on my channel. Everything again will be down in the description box, link below. I do make a small commission from anything that is purchased down below, not from Sephora, just from LTK. So I just wanna be transparent with you guys and say thank you so much if you purchase anything from my support links. The first item, we're gonna do lips because I love lips. And I am wearing it right now and it's this really cute and I just was so sold mainly on the packaging because I'm a girl. I'm just obsessed with all girly things and I love bows. But look at how cute this lipstick is. Like look at that little gold bow, the nice detailing around. It's in a cute color. So this is the Pat McGrath Labs. This is in negligee. This is their satin lipstick. It's what I'm wearing right now. And it's basically like your lip color but better. And it's such a nice sheen i'll do a swatch so you guys can see but it's so beautiful guys i just feel like it moisturizes gives you some nice color um and i just love it on my lips i feel like it is so nice this is going to be like a forever purchase obviously because it's so cute but i just love the color it looks so beautiful with like really anything you're wearing and i just love that it's a bit more satin so it's not super matte but it's also like nourishing but it's not going to like come off easily i just anyways i love it I wanna get more colors, but this is my absolute fave. So again, this is color 494 in the color negligee. So item number two is a lip liner, and this is true and true, such an amazing item. And it's the Sephora brand, so you get 30% off with the Sephora brand items. And it's the Sephora Contour Rouge Gel Lip Liner in the color Dress to the 90s, and it's a number 29. Guys, I'm not wearing it today because this is more brown, whereas what I'm wearing right now is more of like that pinky mauve. But this, it has a retractable um, like twist. You don't have to worry about sharpening it. I'll put it beside this right here. I mean, you probably could wear them both together, but look at how nice. So that is the lip liner right there, obviously. <laughs> Try to get it to focus. It's such a nice brown color. I feel like it goes so nicely, just this lip liner put on some lip gloss, it looks great, or you can put on a nice matte lipstick with this lip liner. It just looks so nice. It's not too dark, it's not too pink, not too brown. It's such a nice shade. And with the Sephora collection, there are so many hidden gems. I'm gonna show you another one later on this video because you get 30% off and sometimes, you know, we overlook how great some Sephora products are. So this is a staple. I'll be repurchasing this when it's done. So item number three is gonna be a blush and it's the Nude Sticks what is this called? Nude Sticks, Nudies Matte, all over face blush color, and it's in the color Naughty and Spice. I love this because it just, I'm wearing it right now actually, and it's just like such a beautiful color. So again, I'll swatch it here. It's just such a nice color. It kind of gives you like that, I'm um, like sun kiss, but still gives you a little bit of a deeper, deeper tone. I just think it looks so nice. And what's cool about this is it does have an applicator on the back, but I don't really ever use it to be honest, but that is an option if you do want to use the brush that comes with it. But I just love my blush brush, so I just use that to apply it. But guys, I am trying my best to kind of get to some more clean makeup products, and this product by Nude Sticks is a more like, it gets you that clean classification at Sephora, that little green check mark. Um, and because of the amount of products most of us use, I just I am trying to scale back on products with like talc and all these chemicals just because we use so many things. I know I love products. I'm obsessed with so many different things and I just want to limit as many of the toxic items as I can and try to integrate more clean products. 
So um, keeping to like the face cheek area is my new obsession. I did purchase this, which I'll share with you what it is in a second if you don't know what it is already. I got this in my most recent Sephora sale haul that I did from, I guess it was like Black Friday, the fall time. I will link that haul above. You'll see so many products as well as I did a get ready with me using this product. I will also link that above. So you have some vids to go and check up on after this one if you are enjoying my content. Um, but this is the LYS contour stick in the color Harmony and I just am obsessed. It is in this beautiful like triangular shape. And again, I will swatch it beside everything else. It just glides on so nice. It's such a nice warm tone brown and it's so creamy. What I love about it is you can obviously make it like thicker for when you do your cheeks, but because it has that point, you can do like your really nice nos, nos, <laughs> really nice nose contouring on here along the side, the bridge, as well as again, the bottom lip, just on the bottom. If you do want to make a little pro tip that I have learned over the years is if you want to just make your lips look voluptuous and have nothing done to them because these are my natural lips. You just put a little bit on the base of your lip and it kind of gives you a shadow when you blend it out. So when you put your lipstick lip liner, it just gives you the illusion of just even more full, juicy, wonderful lips. But I just absolutely love this color. I love how easily it blends. I know I have everything on this hand. I'm trying my best not to get it on anything because I'm wearing like beige. The chair I'm sitting on is a light color beige. So <laughs> we gotta be really careful. Um, but I just love this. I feel like it's so sleek. It's so cute. I just love the packaging because, you know, being a girly girl, you just love when everything looks extra feminine, extra fun. And this actually lasts so long. It does such a nice job. I'm actually wearing it today. But again, if you want to check out that Get Ready With Me, it'll be linked down below because I already tagged it above. But I give my first impressions trying this out in that Get Ready With Me. So yeah, go check it out. But I love this. This is one of my highly recommended um, contours. So staying on the theme of the face, I can't remember what number we're at, but the next item <laughs> is the Too Faced Born This Way Multi-Use Sculpting Concealer. Guys, this concealer is amazing. I have tried a ton of concealers. I hope that that is focused. But this can basically conceal, contour, highlight, retouch, and it is full coverage without it looking cakey, and it is amazing. This I use more so just to kind of like correct if I have any like discoloration or if I have a little acne um, or blemishes, I put this on. It just looks smooth, it blends so nicely, it's full coverage, it's not cakey. I just love it, and this is in the color vanilla. Oh, it's actually made in Italy, which is really cool because I'm half Italian. <laughs> Our next product, of course, I had to offer a recommendation for foundation because I've already kind of covered a lot of those boxes that are part of face makeup. And this is one that I am obsessed with. And I did buy it in that previous Sephora sale haul that I already mentioned earlier on, but it is a more pricey item, but it's so worth it. And it is the Hourglass Ambient Soft Glow Foundation. I'm wearing it today. I wanted to be able to show you guys this, obviously on that get ready with me that I mentioned, but also live with you right here. It gives such an amazing finish. Like it is matte without being like too dry. It is full coverage enough that it doesn't look cakey from being too thick, but it still like covers a lot of your blemishes, makes your skin look so even. Um, it's great. Like Hourglass, I just love this, this brand so much. I Again, like more and more of the products I've been trying, I've been obsessed with, and they're gonna be like my go-tos forever. But this is gonna be definitely a staple. I'm gonna be repurchasing this when it finishes. I got this in the color Ambient 7.5, um, and they do have a wide selection of colors, so that's really nice to be able to match with everyone's skin tone. But it is just so beautiful. It just gives you such a nice coverage with such a nice glow. Um, it just feels so nice on your face. You don't feel like you're wearing anything, which is great. I have applied this with both the Hourglass foundation brush as well as my Beauty Blender, and both of them give you such a good result. Just kind of depends on that day, what I feel like using to put on my foundation. But today I did use my Beauty Blender and it just looks so nice, at least I think so. Uh, but yeah, I highly recommend it because this is a more pricey item. And so next is a total underrated product that is from the Sephora line. I'm obsessed, I'll be repurchasing this. It's so great and it is Sephora's. <laughs> Um, micro smooth multitasking baked face powder. And I got this in 30, like number 30 in the color sand guys, this is such a nice powder. So it kind of goes along the lines of like that blurring powder, like the Charlotte Tilbury, um, airbrush flawless filter powder. Um, I think that's what it's called, but this looks so nice. Again, I wanted to use it today to show you guys. And I use it literally almost every single time I do my makeup for like every day as well as glam, but I do it for like 
um, first starting off to set my under eyes and then my T-zone, any kind of areas I wanna like really lighten and blur. It is so nice, it's long lasting, it's so amazing and it's so inexpensive. I can't remember what the price is, but it's very affordable and you get 30% off because it's from the Sephora collection. It is so great, it's underrated. I don't think a lot of people know about it, but it's the Sephora collection micro smooth powder. The next product is also from the Sephora collection and it is the Sephora shadow and liner. Basically it's their waterproof, colorful glitter eyeliner slash eyeshadow in number 41 in the color rose gold. Guys, I'm wearing it on my inner uh, tear ducts. It is this beautiful, like champagne-y, um, like rose gold-y kind of color. I'm gonna just show you guys. But that is the color right there. And it is such a nice shimmer. It looks so nice. Like you can't really see, I don't have a mirror here, but I'll put some on the inner tear duct just so you guys can see on both so it's even. But it is so pretty. Like. This blends so nicely. I put it as a shadow. I put it as an eyeliner. You can put it underneath your eye line, put it in your inner tear duct to brighten. It is so nice. It applies really well. And I did actually get this also in the matte colors because I was just so obsessed with the formula of this. And the matte, I got it in brown and black and I'm wearing it right now, the brown. You blend it out with a little smudge brush and it just gives you such a nice look. So definitely get this color, but in general, if you need like a good eyeliner slash eyeshadow combo to kind of blend out, make you like that smoky smudge look. So the next product is gonna be moving into skincare and just body care, and it is the Sol de Janeiro Bum Bum Body for Menza Oil. So I bought this in the last uh, Sephora sale that they had, which was in the fall, and I'm so obsessed. I've only been using it sparingly because it is very expensive, which is why I recommend it during the sale because obviously you get 20% off, but it smells just heavenly. I just love that like beach scent. Oh, just like that tropical, like mango, coconut, just, you just, I just love smelling amazing. That's just like one of my favorite things. <laughs> one thing you can't obviously know from YouTube is what I smell like, but this is just one of my go-to scents. And I definitely use this for special occasions because it is more of an expensive item. Um, and I just wanna give myself that nice glow and looking extra nice and put together when I have an occasion, like a nice dress or a function. I wanna smell nice, but make my skin just look glowy and so healthy. And what I love about this oil is when you apply it, it does not like leave that greasy aftermath kind of feeling. Like I can't stand oils that it just lingers and lingers. This one is so nice. I'm gonna do a little mini demo. It just is so nice. Like it just absorbs so nicely and it makes you have like a nice glow to your skin, making it look really healthy. I love it. It's just nourishing. It smells great. Um, I don't know how well it does in terms of the firming aspect. I didn't buy it for that. I bought it just for the scent and having like a really good body oil and the fact that it doesn't make you have that greasy aftermath. Like that is the biggest thing for me when it comes to this product, but I love it. Highly recommend it. So the next item is part of hair care. This is my 10th item in this recommendations video and is one that I have repurchased so much. I cannot live without it. It'll be probably forever part of my hair care routine for my washing system. Um, and it is the Way their detox shampoo. This is literally like the best shampoo. So the key with this is you wash your hair. I just wash with like a, like a decent, not overly expensive, but like a decent um, hair shampoo. And then I always double wash with shampoo. It just makes such a difference to your hair. So I do a regular wash with just whatever shampoo you like or that I have. I just get one from Shoppers. I can't remember the brand. It's not like a typical brand. And then I go in with my second shampoo wash with the Way Detox Shampoo. Really massage it. It smells really nice. It just like froths really nice in your hair. Oh, it just smells, it just smells so squeaky clean when you have this done in your hair, as well as it literally feels so clean. And just, you know, between using products to style my hair, slick back my hair, you don't want to build up anything on your hair because then it just, you can tell it just looks, gets greasy easily, it just doesn't look healthy. Um, but this has been one of my absolute obsessions. My best friend got this onto me like many years ago and I have not stopped using it since she recommended it to me. All right guys, so that takes us to the end of this video. I hope that these recommendations help you with your beauty regime and your purchasing that you wanna do during the Sephora sale. Again, everything will be down in the description box and thank you so much if you do purchase anything from my support links. It really means so much to me. And if you've made it to the end of this video, thank you so much, you're the absolute best and I love that you're here. And if you want me to do any future hauls, let me know if there's any topics, beauty related, fitness, nutrition, let me know because then it gives me inspo for what my upcoming videos will be. So I'll see you soon, see you in the next video. 
stay positive, keep enjoying life, just being your best self, and thanks so much for watching. Mwah.